Hi, today I'd like to talk to you about the iFootage Shark S1 portable slider. It's compact in design, which means it's a great slider to travel with. It comes with a carry case that has hand straps and a shoulder strap. Everything fits into this weatherproof bag. The rails are made of carbon fibre, which are not only strong, but also light to carry. There is a cheese plate design for easy support or mounting to your tripod. The two spirit levels assist setup by making sure the slider is at all times level. The best thing about this slider, which made me buy it, is the wheel counterweight at the end here. It adds inertia to the slide, which makes the camera movement more smoother through dampening. It gives your starts and stops a more feathered movement. You can also add an additional weight for larger cameras or for when using macro lenses. The attached legs are for floor or table mounting, as well as low angle shooting. If you prefer, you can mount the slider onto lighting stands either end. There are three ways to do this, by either screwing into the 3 8 or quarter inch threads, or directly into the spigot hole, which I think is the quickest and best way. There are no tools required to fix or tighten things. This is especially great, of course, when traveling or working fast. The last thing you want to happen is to forget an Allen key or lose it when you're up a mountain getting that fabulous sunset sunrise slider shots. It comes with two extra track lengths, which take it from 700 millimeters to 1200 millimeters. It comes with a longer belt, which is easy to change when extending the track. It can take a seven kilogram camera load with a single set of tracks and a five kilogram camera load with a second set of extension tracks. The join is super smooth. In the next part of this video, we will talk about the motorized attachment for this slider and the remote controller. This makes it work for programmable moves time-lapse functions and stop animations with DSLR camera remote triggering abilities too.